Yikes. This place is wrecked. And yes, I am staying alert. There are probably tons of those Grim around. Good thing you learned the runes, brother.
I think that's everything here. Want to get going? Just, I'm trying to keep our options open. Let's just keep moving. I'm glad we're out here, exploring a new realm. Maybe we could just try to enjoy the warmth. Looks like we gotta find a way to open that gate if we want to get to Nidavolir. Brother, look! That strange bugger popped back out of the ground again! <laughs> Halfway there. There's gotta be another chain to lower the rest of the gate. Look, there's a chain we can pull up there. How shall we catch it? Flank it. Attack the behind. Good. behind it. But how? There must be a better vantage point. Somewhere we can attack it without it seeing us. See what it drops. <laughs> huh. 
There's still the other chain to pull, but how are we gonna get to it? done. Think you can uncover that geyser from here? I don't see how we can get up to that chain. Anything from that block? That's one of Cavassier's poems. Very highbrow. You should collect any others you find. Exactly are you hoping to learn from Tia? Well, like I said, I was hoping he could tell me something about Loki. I'd also like to hear some of his stories. Traveling to other lands, giant stuff, and maybe about what it was like to fight back in the day. Just for the history, obviously. History? <laughs> Let's hope Tia's in a talkative mood after being imprisoned for so long. 
Not all of Odin's captives can be as charmingly voluble as myself. We have no proof Tyr is truly here. Right. That earthquake earlier. Do you think there will be another one? It's unlikely, but geological disturbances tend to be unpredictable. If the geysers and smell here are worse because of Fimble Winter, maybe the earthquakes are too? Aye. You might be onto something, lad. Atreus, look ahead. Wow. Now this looks like a city. Welcome to Nidavellir, brothers. Hey, dwarves! Oh. They're, uh, running away. An alarm. I'd only sound an alarm like that if I still had my body, and was fearing the notion of being detached from it. Why all that for us, though? They are scared. It was definitely an alarm, I'm afraid. Why is everybody hiding? Stay alert. Can we talk we to you for a... any trouble, please? There'll be no help, to be sure. Best we find the tavern Sindri mentioned on our own. The buildings here really are incredible. The detail in the is woodwork is... Is that a statue is... of Odin? They must really love him. Poor fear. Sindri! Hello! I'd return your surprise, but I did know you'd be here. I've got something for you. Oh, definitely need that. What is a dwarf? You know, I'm glad I came back here at least once before. Magnarok. Oh, if these cobblestones could talk. Then they'd have mouths. Filthy, disgusting mouths. Do you mind if I fiddle with your bow? Oh. You are long overdue for a replacement. <sighs> Taking advantage of certain material... Ow! Structural sensitivity to sonic vibrations has been something... Uh, I've been meaning to try for quite some time now. Thanks for, uh, finally trying it? What's it gonna be this time? <sighs> Patience! I find it's best to see these things... In action! Ah. Whew. There. Oh, take aim at that gate there. But before you loose, say Skialfa. Well, I certainly didn't expect you to disturb half the creepy crawlies in need of a lear. How was I supposed to know they were there? Left foot! Target down! <laughs> Okay, so, Derlin. Atreus, this way. Best of luck. It seems like neither Valir's locked down because of us. Mm. 
Sindri, any idea where the tavern is? Do I look like I've ever been to a filthy tavern? The sewer you just punched a hole through seems promising, though. For you. It should lead to the other side of the city. It's not like you're able to open other doors around here. Till we meet again! At your service. So this lockdown really is because of us? Oh my, yes. Odin's grip on this realm is so firm, any outsider is considered a threat. Sounds like a... Them if I ever had one. Whatever you need. What can I make for you? Hey, what happened to all the armor we made you already? I used it. Well, maybe try to make this one last longer. I will not. Huh, that might be my best piece yet today. Very good. Be safe! <laughs> Another of Cavassia's poems.
Best of luck. Well, everyone's hiding on this side too. Odin's occupation of this realm has its hooks in deep. But there aren't any guards patrolling. We're clearly not a threat. Why hide? Resist and you're made an example of, to keep the rest in line. Self-preservation can outweigh bravery for even the strongest of folk. Fear keeps them safe and alive. Yeah. This looks promising, right? Well, it's like a house. If he's here, maybe you should let me do the talking. You. Well, we don't want to intimidate him. You're tall as a tree and you have a severed head on your head. <clears throat> None taken. Fair point, though. Very well. A firebomb from the chief anti-Odin propagandist in Durland's Rebellion. Quite a sharp wit she had until she turned to... We need some special equipment to use this. Hello? Watch yourselves. Apparently, there are intruders about. Oh, that's us, I think. Eh, well, if you're planning on killing me, at least let me finish this song. That alarm was in just the perfect key. We're just looking for a friend of ours named Derlin. <laughs> well, we both know that's not true. Derlin's got no friends left. But if that's all you need, head out the back way there and you'll see the safety office just across the river. Just don't go making trouble for the rest of us. And while you travel through this realm, maybe you could clean up the head's mess? What mess? Later, brother. I wish to hear of this mess. The rig's in the bay. Why don't you ask the... Head!
sorry, one more thing. Although, these are gifts I'm giving to you, so I shouldn't be sorry. You should be thankful. And anyways, here, please be careful. It's beautiful. Thanks, Sindri. It is beautiful, isn't it? It's also very useful. You'll be able to find anything your heart desires with it. Really? As long as your heart desires the locations your father and you decide and plot to travel together, then yes. It is a compass. Ah, but a beautiful compass. Now scamper off. Come. A boat cannot be far. Huh. Really, your Sindri made it sound like Darlin was some sort of rebellion leader. Doesn't sound like anyone's following him. Was being the key word here, little brother. I saw a dock back there. Maybe there's a boat we can use to get to Derlin's. How many stories have you told about Odin and Thor, and all the bad things they've done? Let's see how many we can remember. Seems like Father could use his memory refreshed. My memory of them requires no refreshment. They invaded our home. Yeah, but I'm talking about history. All the other people they've hurt. 
Let's see. Not now. I think it means. I've seen more raiders come back as Hellwalkers lately. I thought freeing the Valkyrie Queen was supposed to restore balance to the realms and keep that from happening. That's a good question, lad. And a troubling. What? If Hell's filled up again, it suggests that something's been hindering Sigrun's efforts. Or perhaps something even more urgent is keeping her distracted and unable to visit. Even occasionally. Yeah. Sorry, Namir. There's a building just past these rocks behind me. Maybe we should head that way. Ah. Uh. Those bloody mining rigs. What about them? The Skald is right to blame me for them. They were my idea. If you've got the time, they're in the bay just beyond this tunnel. I'd particularly appreciate us checking out the mining rigs in the lake to the right. You can see the smokestacks from here. But if you don't want to explore now, it looks like Derlin's place is through that open gate to the left. So, which way do we go? We could prepare more before rescuing Tyr. Up to you. Mimir, were you really the one who had those rigs built? Odin wanted the dwarves under his control, and, well, I convinced him he could buy their allegiance instead of demanding it outright. A trade agreement of sorts. Dragon sculpture is not bad. Yeah! <laughs> 
The first time someone's told me that, I suppose. What is that? Dead. I think I see something. Oh. 
I think we need some special equipment to use this. So not all dwarves can do that thing Brock and Sindri do, right? Or they just walk between realms and turn up somewhere else? Indeed, that's a rare skill. I gather one carefully cultivated by some secretive dwarven guild or other. Probably for the best. Them alone doing it is disconcerting enough. Taking a break before visiting Durlin? Very wise. He can be... a lot. I'll disinfect my tools. By the way, if you're headed to the mining rigs in the bay, Bring me any slag you find? I could use the material for my crafting. Nothing appeals to you? I'm here for you. That belonged to one of the rebels, didn't it? to take that off your hands and wash it. And it's covered in blood. Thanks. Happy to lighten your load. Sure, this will be of some use. I'll heat up the forge.
A good fit. Take care of your armor, and it'll take care of you. One of the mining rigs is here. See the smoke above us? That's where we're headed. Let's see if we can't <clears throat> shut it down. <clears throat> wow, there's a lot to explore here. Kinda nice to be out of Midgard for a bit, huh? Things like they chock a block with materials that could help us. I'd grab whatever it spits up in the process. Every spy. If the 
dwarves agreed to the deal with Asgard, why do they blame you? I talked them into their own exploitation. They made their choice. Work or die is not a choice. I only made it seem so. What you just picked up there is pure Spartalfine form. It won't be of use in the ring anymore, but perhaps our Huldra brothers could craft something from it. Father, is it always moral to kill something that's trying to kill you? Yes. Well, there you have it, lad. It's still here. What? The island near the geyser. We need to get the key from it and unlock this door. We need... I need... To set right a very old wrong. What these rocker holes! We've got to clear out all these undead bastards! Oh. <coughs> it's bad! You're on fire, Kratos! It will pass! <coughs> Oh! 
Oh! <laughs> 
Behind the door. A prisoner of sorts. built to harvest ore for armaments, essentially harnessing resources that would otherwise go to the dwarves. You think shutting these things down will help the dwarves become independent? I don't know, but I have